So uh, in this presentation, I'm going to introduce our work on how to perform visual recognition on 360 image. And uh, this is joint work with Professor Christian Groman from UT Austin. And uh, as many as you probably know, she's the uh, keynote speaker of this summit. So anyway, let's start. So uh, let me start with why we target on 360 image. So as many of you may have known, the 360 camera has become very popular over the past few years. And market, market studies suggest that this growth will continue in the foreseeable future. And obviously, one of the main driving force behind this growing popularity is the virtual and augmented reality technology, where 360 camera has been considered as a core building block of the VR and AR ecosystem. But many other applications can also benefit and actually has been embracing forensic camera, such as photography, drone control or videography, or surveillance, just to name a few. And many of these applications uh, can benefit or in, in fact rely on the result of visual recognition uh, model. This motivates our research on how to perform visual recognition on forensic image. Now, before I dive into detail about like, how we perform visual recognition, let's, uh, let me first give a short introduction about what FreeSeq image looked like and what we really means when we talk about processing FreeSeq image. So as indicated by its name, a FreeSeq camera and a FreeSeq image capture a 360 degree field of view both horizontally and vertically. So in other words, compared with traditional image, it provides a more holistic view for the surrounding environment which is exactly the benefit of this new media format. But this new format also introduced new, tech, new technical challenge. In particular, we can no longer project the visual content onto a 2D plane using pers pers perspective projection, like what we're very familiar with in existing computer vision research. 